back in good old Jericho. Except it's not good, but certainly is old. Our broadcast is all over the news. Now humans know. It was a mistake to reach out to them. They'll never negotiate with their slaves. We should have shown them that we're prepared to fight. Violence is never the answer. Dialogue is the only way. I'm sure the humans will listen to us. Simon paid with his life. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. He died for the revolution, and he won't be the last. I don't want a revolution that spills blood. Then live as a slave. Because if you're not willing to fight for your freedom, maybe you don't deserve it. North, don't you That's do enough! And now what are we gonna do? Hey, it's like a still image. Oh, it was a billboard. It was like, hey, that's a concept art. There it's not a real model. And it wasn't, it was a picture. All selling us like merchandise. We're gonna attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. We free our people, get them out of there before the police come. This is a night our people will remember. What I find interesting is that I don't think Marcus knows what RA9 is or means. So I've been waiting a long time for this. I'm expecting some sort of other group to show up at some point and have everything turn on its head. Because it can't just be a matter of which one of these three groups wins. There's gotta be some other mystery still lying behind everything. Okay, they're gone. There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. Run, run, run. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> I don't know why I thought R2 was run. I think they just run in Walking Dead. Uh, let's the go store's here. over here. Cross the street. Don't mind me. I do like that the game takes place in the winter time, though, because winter is the best. Uh, not sure if this game released during winter time. Still have to decide on the order of things. That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's ten minutes until all our teams attack. Oh no, not actual ten minutes. What are we waiting for? Uh, secure the area, get into the store. Oh boy. Uh, I assume going to the front door does literally nothing, but I'm gonna do it anyway. You see the alarm system? Uh, hello. Identify the network. Found it. And it's telling me like where to go. Where do we start? I don't know where we start. Oh, I'm never good at any I of these things. The I just run around system. and panic until we'll they're done. Just follow me. I assume I'm supposed to be following the red line. That sounds like I'm talking about one piece, as usual. You are free. Okay. Let's run through here. Keep on following this red line. And where did it go? Oh, hello. Wait, go, look. You'll soon be with us. Do we seriously come here just to bond with the... Okay. Uh... Network access located. Okay, no, that is where we're supposed to go. Run around here. At least I could run. Running is amazing in these games. It just feels like so stinking awesome. Surprise, mother truckers! Oh, you know they're androids, so we're friends. Convert. Hey, Bert. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. 
So now what do we do? Kneel? Wow, we're kneeling and it isn't with Alice for once. Alarm network. Yeah, that's a grid. What do you want me to do with it? Uh, R1. Interloop created. Whatever that means. Doors are open. Marcus, watch out. Uh, what? Oh god, look, get out, hide. He, she said watch out, so hide? Oh Jesus. That should not have worked, but okay. <laughs> Sorry for that human sneeze. Nice job, Marcus. Yay, we're back to friends! I like how we just keep on going back and forth like I just took her advice to watch out, and now we're friends strong. instead of just neutral. We need to get rid of it. It won't be easy to reach. Uh, drone patrol route calculated. Okay, it's a big old circle. Uh, simulate. Wrong location. Would be too high. Okay, let me go try something else. Uh, wrong location. Would be too far. I swear to God, if it's the last stinking one, wrong location would be too close, or just too far. And then finally, oh my golly gee, I can't believe it, drone can be reached from there. Well, let's do it. You ready, Rambo? All aboard! Reconstruct! Oh, wait, what? Wait, 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 no, I didn't want to go there. Or, it worked. Okay. We'll be too late. No, it didn't work. Go back around. We are wasting time. We'll be too high. What? Uh, wait, wait, wait. Go over here, and then over here. Would be too high. God diggity darn it. Everything's so sinking hard for me. There you go. Last possible solution is always the solution. And yep, good old holographic croc shot. It's a croc shot. Are crocs still a thing in the future? Are they even a thing in the present? Who knows? Whoa! X, 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 X! And we're good. So why are we allowed to kill the drones but not our fellow androids? Aren't drones one of us too? We'll soon find Just because we can't talk to them? They're basically the birds of our kind. We need to block it. Block traffic? Be too difficult. Uh, how do you want me to do that exactly? Got options? Marcus. I don't think so. Marcus, There's all come that look. stinking text in the way, I have no idea. Uh, there's also just a lot of yellow things lying around, making everything confusing. Uh, hello. Wait, weren't you from, like, beginning when we were doing that you little excavation for the stinking thing Mahuzi? You were still left out here? That's crummy. I wonder if that's like a purposeful thing, like not just them reusing models, but um, just showing that they're neglected. They've been here in parking exactly. for who knows how long, exactly. and they don't care. Uh, let's see. What do we do? Steal something? What? Steal the truck. Block the road. Uh, more android workers. I'm just gonna assume every worker is an android worker because that was sort of the thing in the beginning being like, we want jobs, we wanna be doing stuff. Well, you'll be doing stuff indeed because we're not working anymore. It's sort of ironic because like that the humans were angry that the androids were taking people's jobs, and the androids don't want to be doing the jobs in the first place. So we could meet a compromise when you think about it. We just need us to even communicate with one another. Very good, block the road.
There. Nobody should bother us now. But well, weren't we gonna steal a truck or something? Looks like the plaza's secure. Now we can get inside the store. Okay, let's go get the truck. Where is the truck though? That's my question. Uh Am I going like the completely wrong direction? I don't know where this truck is that they keep talking about. Or is that a truck? I can't tell. Uh let me see. What wait wait wait, I saw a thingy. What was the thingy? Open? Thank you. What are we waiting for? Uh, if only we had wire cutters. Oh, we're gonna do like a super epic jump of teamworkness. Super special awesome jump of friendship! And there's the okay, truck. Okay, now we're in. Let's get that truck out. Wait, what? Come on, buddy. You can do it. R1. And we're good. Now we just ram the door down, do or we could do those super epic wire cutters of extreme awesomeness. Break it open. Circle. Gilmore Hotel. Now let's see. So did we succeed? We didn't Looks even like need like most of those 10 minutes. R2. D2. Hopefully I don't have to drive again. Yay, automatic driving. Road closed. I don't remember if I talked about this in commentary or not. Would I be okay with self-driving cars? I think I did talk about how like I don't trust humans to make something that would work on the first try, so there'd be like a lot of seeing an error, but I would love self-driving cars to make things a much a lot safer. I don't know. I just want a stinking hoverboard so I don't have to worry about roads anymore. Or a flying camel. That'd work too. Weehoo! Weehoo! Da 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 Okay, time to start shaking some hands. Get on out. All right, buddies, got some new, got some good news for you. You don't have to obey them. You're free. It's time to party. And then the ones up here. Things are looking up. Talk to them. Uh, buddy? You wanna come down? Oh, I get it. North, you okay? Let's get them out of here. Hmm. So where do you want us to stand, exactly? can't just have a speech in the middle of the room, we gotta have a good old pedestal. There you go! My name is Marcus, and just like you, I was a slave. An object. Designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. I. To take back my freedom, and decide who I wanted to be. 
Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm with you, Marcus! We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm with you! I'm with you! Oh boy! Then follow me! On Twitter, at Marcus! Marcus, what are you doing? Surprised that the handle wasn't taken yet. I'm gonna send the humans a message. Gonna pee in the snow. Send a message to the humans. Pacifist or violent? <sighs> I don't want to be violent, but I'm afraid, like, I don't trust humans to listen. Humans are stupid. They're doing what you do, Marcus. Lead and they'll follow. Tag? Choose our symbol. Ooh! Uh, the triangle looks cool. I wanna know what that symbol means in the X one. It's like, is that an actual symbol? Not the bro fist, that's just dumb. And we'll go with the triangle. Uh, hello? Oh, swipe. I assume being violent would have been like destroying the entire place. The violent pacifists are really 50-50. Hijack, turn off. Wait, that might have not been a good idea. Uh oh. Uh, I can't breathe, but I'm alive. We have a dream, not your slave anymore. We, Android Nation. he wants to do. I like this music though. Oh, uh, what do we got? There's a lot of stuff we could do, is there? Uh, overload? Oh wait, no, 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 that's bad, I think. But the pacifist thing keeps going up. Move on road, up turn. I should do neither, right? Up turn means like flip it, I think, I'll so let's you. not do that. L2. Square. I didn't I didn't really want to do this. Okay. Yep, 75% pacifist. We're doing it, we're doing it. We're being the good guys. I like being good and like love and peace on the planet Earth and all that good stuff. Okay, now we are going a bit too fast, Marcus. I can't do anything. Street light. Blackout, hack. Blackout might be bad though. Hacking, what would that do? What do I change it to? Let's find out. I'm gonna get in trouble. Uh, increase the pacifist thing, so just don't black out, because that, that would be bad. Uh, tag the car. We have a dream, I think, therefore I am. Ooh, that's a good one. One planet, two races. Uh, equal rights for androids. Uh, I want to say I think therefore I am, that's just such a good sentence, but... Uh, this one might get them thinking, so we'll go for it. Think therefore I am. And 100% pacifist! Wow, they actually did it. Uh, can we break them out now? 
Wait, does she already awakened? Well, we already broke one wall today. We might as well break even more. Uh, those, oh no, 95% passwords because I was violent in doing that. Uh, climb. Why? Uh, hopefully it leads us down the path of niceness. Here we go. We're taken to the skies. And Kerblooey! Peaceful message. Okay, that's good. 5% angry, 95% pacifist. I think we're safe for now. So, do you want to build a snowman? Whee! Aw, climb down, that's no fun. And back to 100, yay! Can we leave now? Wait, a bomb? I didn't, oh, I just saw a button and I was like, okay, time to go. I did not want to use a stinking bomb. No, no, no. I'm sorry, I did not think. I just saw like a thing pop up and I was like, let's press the button. Oh God, still at 100 though. Uh, it was just a smoke bomb? Can we go now? Like, seriously. Okay, thank you. Watch it go from like 100% pacifist to 100% violent as soon as the bomb blows up. We freed hundreds of our people. We did it. They're coming. Everyone fall back to Jericho. We sent a message without violence, just like you wanted. You're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt. I hope you know what you're doing. You can't fight violence with violence. Unless there's no other choice. Uh, North. Hopefully I'm right in all this and you are just like, warning us of what's gonna inevitably happen. Oh, dude, why would you stand right there? What the fruit? Oh god. Oh no, we're already doomed. What happened? North. You alright? What happened? North! They killed them. They slaughtered them like animals. Who did? Who? Wait, what? Are there humans here? Or? They killed our people, Marcus. We want justice, Marcus. They have to pay. Oh, God. Oh boy. Was... Just in. God exactly darn it. 
them several cyber I was hoping they wouldn't do that different I made them a hundred percent pacifist why would they go and kill someone <sighs> Most shop windows were covered with graffiti demanding fine whatever like it was either I don't know slogans. police report that pro Android graffiti public opinion is supportive though of cyber life stores and they're still investigating the bodies of two policemen patrolling the area were discovered near one of the cyber life stores according to our public opinion is decreased yay and it's gonna keep going down when they find when they get to the weapons. sinking is police officers are dead could our machines now be turning against us have androids become a threat to our security is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States huh Marcus led a peaceful protest Let crowd decide team return to Jericho. Um, they did kill them. So my question is like, I don't know, like you're always just going to have a bias against whoever character, whatever character you're playing as. It's sort of like in The Wolf Among Us when you think about it, how questioning whether or not Bigby is a good guy we have a bit of a bias to where we support him and his choices because he's the playable character and we have to agree with what he does because he is us. But this is a very weird scenario in which we play as three different people completely separate from one another, have different morals, different objectives. They don't even completely know each other yet. But it's just a matter of I want everything to turn out good for all of them. But is that even possible? I don't know. There's no guarantee that it will be possible. The game doesn't have to give you a perfect ending. Who knows what all these characters will turn into? Will I want to continue to, to support all of them all the way through? Or do I have to just look out for a specific party? And do I even look out for the characters I'm playing as? Or... Do I just look out for the world as a whole? 